The re-announcement with just a few weeks notice given to us before the exam puts us all in stress since most of the doctors have already resumed duties at various hospitals. Another thing is that most of the doctors are working in the COVID department and they are bonded with a three-month period. And if they are to leave their jobs, they still would have to give a one month prior notice before resignation. Many doctors have migrated to different cities than they were before. Transportation and commutation to the exam center still remains a big hassle. Many doctors are still COVID positive and another mass gathering would only add fuel to the fire. It's a humble request, sir. Please postpone IRNSAAT. Like all the other exams have been postponed, including HPG. I'm sure we are as equal a part of the country as anybody else. And I'm sure we'd be heard. And I'm sure we'd be resolved. This is Doctor speaking for many other doctors who have joined COVID duties after PM announcement. Since we have our contracts of three months in private hospitals and this sudden announcement of INSET exam dates have made our life miserable. With more and more cases reported on a daily basis, around 1.5 lakh cases per day, and we know it's not easy for us. So, exam should be considered to be conducted on July. Thank you. Requesting the concerned authorities to kindly postpone INICPT because, firstly, majority of the aspirants are doing 100 days COVID duty as are as are the, the government of India. Secondly, most states are in the thirdly, government has promised that they won't conduct any exam before August end. Fourthly, most of the aspirants are not even vaccinated. On 3rd May 2021, we were told to join COVID duties to serve the nation. As desperate times demand desperate measures, we joined the COVID duties. I started working, thinking that the exams will be after August 31. On May 27th, there was this sudden announcement of INICT exam dates, giving us a mere 19 days to prepare, which is highly impossible after not being in touch with the book since one month. Many of us have joined COVID duties and did not get enough time to study. All we ask for is a month prior notice before the exams. As many of us have migrated to different places to work, travel will be a huge concern as many of the states will be under strict lockdowns. The CBSA exams got cancelled. Ames nursing exams got postponed. Why not ours? Hey everyone, as per a decision taken by PMO, that is, NEAT PG has been postponed by three months and will not be conducted before August 31st. This decision was to divert the NEAT PG aspirants toward COVID duties, to strengthen the failing healthcare system during the time of crisis. Whereas many of us, PG aspirants, have joined COVID duties, not just joining but also we have signed 100 days contract. If not the contract, at least one month prior notice is being demanded by the hospitals we are working at. Last year, around 80 to 1 lakh students appeared for INSCT. So this year, it's going to be much higher. The need PG aspirants who have been working at COVID hospitals will be appearing for the exam and pose a risk of disease transmission to those who are not, in turn putting family members at risk. There is a subset of doctors who have been preparing for the exam and they have not been vaccinated, maybe because they are not working in the front line or because of the vaccine shortage. INSCT is one of the career deciding exams. At least one month prior notice should be given. It becomes very difficult for the need PG aspirants to devise the entire MBBS in just 18 20 days span of time. It becomes even more difficult for those doctors who are being mentally and physically drained working at COVID hospitals. Kindly make some efforts to save the PG aspirants. Otherwise, the mental stress, anxiety would be on the top list within COVID. Looking at the above points, Kindly consider our concern and postpone the exam till second wave subsides. And please do inform about the examination date a month prior. This is the least we struggling doctors ask for. Thank you.